to the channel guys today is an awesome video we got for you guys i've got two very important guests in the studio we've got little maddox over here who's five years old and we've got mateo who is seven you guys have previously remember mateo featured during lockdown in a lap time challenge around the nurburgring that video was highly successful so we thought well let's bring these two back into our videos and let's see what uh, we can do with them today so mateo and maddox have challenged their father to a simulator race we're going to discuss the track and the car in a moment. But for now, let's find out what their opinion is on that. And let's see if they can actually believe they can beat their dad. So let's start with you, Maddox. Do you think you can honestly beat your dad around the track? Um, yes, I'll kick your butt. You'll kick my butt. And what track do you want to race me on? Majoria Go-Kart. Majoria Go-Kart. That's a challenge I accept. Mateo, what about you? Do you think you can beat me? Yes, definitely. I'll kick your butt. And on what track as well? Lamar in a pure one. Ooh, that's a nice challenge. So guys, as you can see, both these guys are dressed in their full race suits. Um, that's because they actually do race. You'll see uh, they're sponsored by, well, they race for a team called Ralph Schumacher, who is a well-renowned racer himself in the old days of Formula One. Um, he's the brother of Michael Schumacher, seven times world Formula One champion. In the background here, you see his two photographs of Matteo and Maddox's carts. In the left is 28, which is Mateo. On the right is 29, which is Maddox. So just to bring you all up to speed with how they've done this year in their series, both these youngsters race in the Rotax Max uh, Challenge in karting here in South Africa. They race in the five to nine year old category. And as I said earlier, Maddox is five, Mateo is seven. So both of them fall in the younger part of uh, the group of kids racing. But don't let that fool you. Uh, Maddox this weekend in the Africa Open was sitting pretty in about 4th or 5th position when he crashed out unfortunately. Matteo kept his head in the game and he finished 2nd overall in the whole country of the best 17 kids there were racing. In the National Series this year, Matteo finished up 4th overall in South Africa against 8 and 9 year old boys. He did exceptionally well at one stage, he was actually leading the series. And Maddox finished mid-pack at 10th um, for 5 year old being the youngest kid, he did exceptionally, exceptionally well. So guys, we're really excited for them uh, next year to see how they perform. Maddox will still be taking part in the Bambino series, but Matteo has moved up to Kid Rock, which is a slightly older age group where he still will be a probably two or three years younger than most of the guys. But we believe he's got the talent and the ability to actually um, compete for, for a championship. So without a due, guys, sit back, get comfortable, and let's see if dad can beat the kids. But before you do that, like, subscribe, and hit the notification. Okay, guys, so we've got a bit of a problem. I have my machine, which is still doing a software update, so we've got a little bit of time to wait. So while I'm waiting for that to happen, let me just show you the boys. They're practicing hard right now because they know they can't beat their dads. They're going to get some extra lap times in. So let me pan over and let you see what the guys are up to. So here's Mateo. He's riding a G4 Sim seat. It's a carbon fiber structure and he has a Logitech G29 steering wheel and as you can see Mateo left foot brakes, you get a lot more of that in the video later on and here he is grinding hard, practicing, practicing to take on his dad. So we've got Maddox over here and Maddox is also in a G4 Sim uh, carbon seat with the Logitech G29 multifunction steering wheel and he also Left foot brakes. Let's see. Let's see Maddox in action here. Doesn't look like he needs to brake at this rate. Okay, hairpin coming. There we go. On the brake, back on the gas. And then this is my setup, guys. This is the play seat Formula One seat with a Thrustmaster F1 wheel. And just out of interest, guys, here yeah, you can see some of the trophies that Maddox and Mateo have won this year karting. It's been a very successful year and a half, should I say. Uh, some fantastic trophies there from some really, really good uh, results. And then here's something else to show you guys that's pretty cool. This is a guy I found on Instagram. I'll send you guys the link below the video. These are all the tracks of the world, Formula 1 tracks of the world. So really, really cool for a man cave check them out guys okay so it looks like we're almost ready to race see you on track this is it winner takes all fist pumps good luck boys so we're not racing gloves okay daddy's 
on Paul. Maddox on second. Let's have a third. He's watching from the let's back. Give it, let's give it a one, boys. I'm going to tuck on the first. Dad takes an early lead. It's in turn one. Oh, both boys come inside him. Let's see if I can make it up turn two. So, guys, it's a four lap race. No, uh, yeah. Yep, four. four laps. First lap is your out lap, and then we've got three hot laps. So, let's see who can pull off as champion of the Mason household tonight. Oh, I'm coming back at you, boys. I'm coming back at you, guys. I'm not going to take B because now I'm going to beat the turn. I love your helmet, man. It's just like your real one. Just try to get into it, it's a slip Oh, he's going on the inside from the defensive. I'm going to hold my line down the outside. Break a little bit late to the turn, turn in. Down shift to second, third. Short shift back up. Maddox on my butt. I can feel the pressure coming from Maddox. So guys, as you can see, both Mateo and myself are running manual gearboxes. Maddox is on auto. Not to say that either is any faster, it's just personal preference. And you can see all three of us are left with breaking. Sorry. Oh, I right. made you Mateo. Both fight back. Well, both coming down my left hand side. Who takes fastest left? Maddox. Okay, guys, we're itching into the third lap. So, again, no one wants to make a mistake, obviously, to keep together. He fights it out all the way to the end. Oh, we're going down the inside of Maddox, so keep away from the sausage curve. Maddox around you a bit wide there. Oh, with Maddox and I fighting, Mateo's pulled away a little bit. Chase him, Maddox, chase him down, boy, I'm in your slipstream. Let's put him back. As you can see, obviously the slipstream is very strong and it works very well. So you just got to keep keep it together. And the race uh, the race stays very close. Whoa! I nearly lost it. And Maddox is right there. Maddox is right there. 0.6 off me, 9.6 off the tail. So it's anybody's race for guys. Comment it, uh, leave a comment below, guys, and say who you think is going to win this race. Is too wide, he knows he's like an old fox. Oh, he's left it too late. Maddox is going to get away, and the slipstream's not going to work. Oh my word! Oh my word! Who's going to take it on the line? Who's going to take it on the line? Oh, did he get it? No, Maddox gets the win. Wow, guys, that was right down to the line. It was absolutely that was amazing. Such a great race. How, how about, far? How about one of us go again? How far? <laughs> How about all of us go again? No. Yeah. I'll take a second any day of the week. Guys, look at me. I'm sweating here. That was tough as nails to try and beat these two little kids. This one, Mateo, and this little one, Maddox, here, who took the championship. So, Maddox, well done, boy. Mateo, please give our champion the trophy. Yes, well done. So, Maddox, the champion of the day. What do you have to say, bud? Um, that was an enjoying race and I loved it. And what was your secret? Why did you actually beat Mateo and Dad? Because I had a, pull, a pulled back on the other corner. A switchback? Yeah. Switchback. And then you got in the toe? Yeah. That's fantastic. So you know that all my friends are going to laugh at me now because you beat me. Should they laugh at me? Yes. Or should they say that you are actually so fast you'll beat them as well? I'll beat them as well. 
And you, Mateo? It was close. Very close race. It was very close until, until I this guy lost it for too long at the end. But luckily, uh, I got the slip screen and I quickly passed that on just before the night. That's brilliant. I think you waited too late eh, on the inter jump and Maox got away. So, anyway, guys, thanks some more for watching. Hey, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell and give us some comments. Bye, guys.